One of the biggest features that's in the new version 13 of Tower is a family manager, which can be used to manage various combinations of body and leg extensions within a single Tower model. This new feature can be accessed under the Model Family Manager menu item. When you first open that up, you'll see various combinations of families that we've already built in our uh, example tower here. If we were to go look at a 20-foot body with 20-foot legs, you will see that particular configuration right here. If you want to build a new configuration, you can copy an existing configuration. We do recommend starting with the tallest body extension and the longest legs for your first tower model. Once you get that done, you can copy that. When you have your new configuration, it's at the bottom of the list here. We can edit that particular configuration and we can give it a name and description of whatever our new configuration would be. You can pick any one of your existing body combinations that we've already built. You can also right click, create a new one, and even copy an existing one to modify to make another body extension. Lots of tools in there to help you out. Don't forget the right click option. On the legs, it's the same way. So we can come in here and pick various different legs that we wanted to use on our body extensions here. If you wanted to create a new one, you can right click and create. Although it is much easier to take an existing leg and adjust it for the new leg. And again, we recommend starting with the longest leg. It'll make it easier. And we'll just pick, we'll leave that on 30. When I click OK here, we'll see our new configuration with our 20 foot body extension and our various legs here. Now, if you want to access all of your towers configurations at one time, there is a table button right here. And this table button is all the various configurations. And you can see here the one that we were just working on is here. So if you wanted to uh, come in and very quickly pick, pick a different body extension and whatever you want to do here, you can take advantage of copy and paste and copy and fill and big build various combinations of all your towers right here in a table. That might be an easier way to do a large number of towers. Once you get your configurations all built, uh, you'll notice that we can um, show the interface planes. This would be the translucent blue and pink planes that you see here that show the interfaces between the basic body, the body extensions, and the legs. Uh, when you do want to do the analysis, you can run the analysis on all of the body and leg extensions at one time, or you can only run on the active one, in other words, this particular configuration that we have here. I'm going to go ahead and do all the body and leg extensions for our demonstration here. And I'm also going to open up a deformed geometry view for every one of the combinations of body and leg extensions. Normally you wouldn't turn that on, but I'm going to leave it on for the fun of it here so we see what we have when we do our analysis. I'm going to go ahead and close out the uh, family manager. And I do want to point out, since this is the tower that we have shown, there's the active tower. If you were to do a group information, for example, and look at some members in the 20-foot uh, body extension, you'll see that you're going to the table with the 20-foot body members. The 40-foot body members are there as well, but they're not applicable for this particular configuration. Uh, so that allows you to work on each configuration and build it exactly the way it is. Now that we've got our desired combinations of body and leg extensions all built up in, in the family manager, let's do an analysis of the entire family. Let's do a model run. When the analysis is complete, we'll be presented with the summary report, which shows the overall body and leg extension combinations and which member is being maximum stressed under which particular configuration on there. It also goes on to further the break down the compression section and the tension section of each one of the members that are on there. If we minimize this report, since we asked for a graphical view of all the configurations, we can do a window tile vertical, and there's each one of the configurations. So of course you could open up any one of these particular configurations, click on the set button, and explore the various uh, usages and tension compression values or whatever you want to about each particular configuration. We hope that this quick overview of the new Family Manager will help you see how it works. For more detailed information, please see the latest Tower Manual. Do want to point out that this also works with the member optimization as well, so you can optimize an entire family of towers with one click of a button.
If you'd like to learn more information about our software, you can see our website at www.powline.com. If you'd like some information about our software, you can contact us directly at info at powline.com. And finally, if you would like to purchase our software, you can contact our sales team directly at sales at powline.com. We look forward to hearing from you soon.